What is cracking, internet bros? I am Uncle Jam, and this is what's cracking. Boom, yeah, we got a D&D &D Adventures in Cor Forgotten Realms gift edition. Look how shiny the box is. Ooh, this has been kind of a dud of a set. Let's get the old knife box out. Oh, I hate the knife box. And look, I got something cool today. Oh, yeah, look at that master sword goodness. Uh, yeah, yeah. All right, let's get this thing open. And it is surprisingly sharp. Yeah, yeah! Anyway, this has been a kind of a lackluster set as far as value goes. I mean, nostalgic for whatever. People who are into this kind of thing. I'm not really, but I always buy a bundle of every set. So here we go. Anyway, this thing comes with, whoa! Wrapper's going everywhere. This thing comes with the stupid knife box. Ooh, and our dungeon cards. Boom, yeah, three of them oversized bad boys. And the knife box that doesn't have anything in it, ever! Put a surprise in there sometimes, wizard. That'd be great. And then we get like a weird little storybook card. Player's manual, boom, read it. If you can open it, you can't open it because it's nothing. Anyway, and we get a nice shiny box full of packs. And then a spin down that isn't a spin down. 20 sided die. And I think in the picture, I noticed. Yeah, it's a spin down in the picture. See, how the map. That, 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 that's false advertising. What's going on here? I was kind of hoping this was going to be an actual spin down because the regular bundle, they have the 20 side, the D20 or whatever. So I was kind of hoping to just get a sweet spin down, but I don't know. Pretty nice. MH2 was kind of purplish too, so whatever. I ain't gonna roll it. You ain't gonna see the numbers. And then let's check out the art. We never usually check out the art. I stick it in the back. Ooh, somebody's having a bad day. Boom, smells like barbecue. Okay, let's get into these packs. I'm gonna make you guys a little deal because this is such a lackluster in value. Let's check out the lands and then the, boom. Oh yeah, and uh, somebody requested that I put the price on the card so boom yeah that's for you buddy okay anyway here's the deal we got the collector pack and we got the 10 boosters what's gonna happen is if I can't pull a mythic out of one of these and I'd love that old knob bone you guys know me I got my green stompy and uh old knob bone would be real nice in there this collector back pack if I can't get a mythic is gonna have a date Get her in the frame here with the 12 gauge hence the shells okay so we'll see we'll see what the destiny of this collector booster is and we'll open her up afterwards anyway i've rambled on enough this uh set like i said not huge value i haven't opened a bundle in a while i opened a mh2 bundle not too long ago and that was pretty good and then i decided well screw it Let's open another one. First rare treasure chest. No mythic. Uh-oh. Island. And uh, the second one did not go very well. $100 a bundle and I got pretty hosed. I didn't even post the video. It actually kind of turned out kind of crappy. The uh, audio wasn't great. I was out fishing. Oh, these are cool. I love this art. Showcase, I think they're calling it. Well, everything different showcase now. Boom. The next. Oh, there's a mythic. There's a mythic right off the bat. Xanthar, Guild Kingpin. Okay, well, Collector Booster, you are saved. Oh, sweet, and a foil rare minion of the mighty. Awesome. Green Cobalt, or Red Cobalt for one. This has got to be good. I never even read this before. Whenever minion of the mighty attacks, if you attack with creatures, total power six or greater in combat, you may put a dragon creature from your hand into the battlefield tap and attacking. That's pretty good. It's got to be decent in foil, eh? Ten bucks or so, I would guess. I don't know. Okay, let's get the rares there. Pretty cool. Uh, I guess we can put the mythic on the pack there. If I get, let's say I get two more mythics, I'll open the pack. If not, we'll wait till the end. Eh? How about that internet bros? Ooh, what's that back there? Ooh, I'm giving things away. All right. Yeah, I can't believe how hosed I got. Actually, you know what? Screw it. Let's do a little bit of editing and uh, 
Let's check out what I got in that MH2 box. Boom! Hose Town. Absolute Hose Town. Can you believe that? For a $100 bundle? Holy moly. Especially with all the good rares. Ranger class for a rare. It was unbelievable. Disappointing. Tomb of Annihilation. Cool. One of the dungeon uh, tokens. Put that to the side. Eh, why not? Maybe we'll try and speed this up a little bit. And this is going to be a 10 minute bundle. Wow. That's not like me. I'm not even eating hot peppers or anything. You can check that out too. I'll throw a link in the description if you haven't seen it. Okay, so. Gretchen. Reaper's Talisman. And another rare Volo. Okay, yes. And an angel token. Friday Night Magic Girl. Boom, yeah. Okay, so. One mythic so far. That's yeah, uh. Oh, that's a cool little goblin token. Is that a girl goblin? Look at that hair. Hmm? Or maybe just a rock and roll goblin. Alright. Boom, yeah. And our rare is... Asmodeus, the Archfiend. Ooh, a nice forest. Guess where that's going. These cards feel kind of... Almost... Oh, another cool dungeon uh, token. That's not too bad. These, uh, guess where this is gonna go? Right in the mono green stumpy, hopefully with my uh, green dragon. That'd be pretty cool, old knobbone. Um, yeah, like I was saying, these feel like kind of waxy, almost like uh, the Ultimate Masters cards. It's not too bad, I don't mind it. I kind of wish they'd bring back that feel of, uh, I don't know if you guys remember the Dominaria cards that felt almost like textured. Oh, we got one of those cool lands in the back there. Oh, I'm just spoiling it. Oh, I think these uh, these land cards look so cool. Green Dragon, not the Green Dragon I'm looking for. Hive of the Eye Tyrant, what a cool card. That's so awesome. Good rare, oh, and a Foil Druid class, all right. Oh, and another two, oh, two Tomb of Annihilations. We'll see if we get all three of these. Uh, yeah, that's so cool. I guess it's the the book covers, maybe, or something, I would have to guess. I wasn't a big fan of D&D back in the day. I was doing other things. Playing a little magic. Riding my bike and all the other wholesome stuff. Man. Denai and Delina. Wild Mage. And a plane. Ooh, that's some nice artwork there. That's pretty cool. It is like an inner world planes. Awesome. And a zombie token. Okay, three packs left to go. We've only got the one mythic. Good foil rare though, so that's pretty decent. This box has already got to be beaten. <laughs> that MH2, man. Oh man, I, I'm still not over that. That was just heartbreaking. Like, those things are supposed to be a home run. Oh well. Forsworn Paladin and a foil. Uncommon. Ooh, and a wolf token. And a flip flip. Flip flip. What's his name? Flip flip. Alright, two packs left to go. Oh, are we gonna save this thing right till the end? One mythic. One mythic. My uh I think my MH2 first MH2 box was just chock full of mythics. It was pretty pretty Pretty, pretty good blue dragon and a uh, cool yeah this showcase art is pretty awesome too i love the basic it's pretty cool that's all i can say about it. it's pretty cool all right last pack of cracks there jackie boy is there a jackie boy watching throw it in the comments i'm jackie boy i'm jackie boy uncle jam oh i'm making a mess oh guys that's why i put the oh 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 legendary planeswalker mythic eliwick the tumblestrom cool this is one that takes you into dungeons i will take it boom another mythic 
and a planes and a to another tomb of annihilation three of those bad boys okay so let's get into the meat and potatoes of the whole bundleino this is probably going to be the only collector pack i open at this set well, it's cool i got the I got the emblem on popper down there. Oh yeah, I guess this won't be a double-sided card. Pop the emblem down right with the planeswalker. Right on. Okay, right, so are we gonna slow roll this whole thing? Let's do it. They're all foils. Improvised weaponry. We got the oh, we got the red dragon now. That's three of the color dragons that I noticed anyway. Okay, here's our foil planes and our first rare Zalto. Come on, old knobbone. Mantle of the Ancients. Three wish, three rares, not too bad. Oh, so this is a commander card? Yeah, okay, cool. Mantle of the Ancients, commander card. Jin Windseer. Loathsome Troll. Mind Flare, cool. And a Mimic Foil. And true polymorph and that's it that is it all right take her easy internet bros